Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to discuss MOSFET biasing circuit problem. Understanding this is a crucial for working with the MOSFET in amplifier and uh, switching application. Let's move further. In this MOSFET circuit, we are considering gate voltage Vg is equal to 3.3 volt the drain current id is equal to 5 milliamps and uh, drain voltage vd is equal to 10 volt and pinch up voltage vp is equal to minus 2 volt and uh, drain saturation current idss is equal to 10 milliamps and the voltage divider current to the gate which is equal to 0.1 milliamps and the supply voltage VDD is equal to 20 volt. Here is the circuit and uh, our goal is to find out the resistor R1 and uh, the resistor R2 and the source resistance RS and the drain resistance are to achieve the desired biasing condition. As we know that in the saturation region, the drain current IC is equal to IDSS into 1 minus VGS divided by VP to the whole square. So we will start by finding VGS by using the saturation equation. This equation relates to the drain current ID to the gate to source voltage VGS. ID is equal to 5 milliamps equal to IDSS equal to 10 milliamps times 1 minus VGS divided by minus 2 volt because we have considered pinch up voltages minus 2 volt to the whole square that is equal to 5 milliamps divided by 10 milliamps equal to 1 plus VGS divided by to the whole square and uh, which is equal to the square root of 5 equal to 1 plus VGS divided by 2 volt and which we simplify this we will get VGS divided by 2 is equal to minus 0 0.293 so that VGS equal to 0 0.586 volt that means the voltage between gate to source will be minus 586 volt. Now let's find the value of source voltage Vs. And we know that the voltage Vgs is equal to Vg minus Vs. And uh, we know the value of Vgs and the Vg. Let's plug the value. Vgs is equal to minus 0 0.586 volt equal to Vg is equal to 3.3 volt minus Vs. If we rearrange the term, we will get Vs is equal to 3.3 volt plus 0 0.586 volt. So that Vs is equal to 886 volt. Now we can calculate the source resistance Rs by using Ohm's law. So that Rs is equal to Vs divided by ID. So the saturation reason, what are the current flowing through the drain will flowing to the source. So that Rs is equal to 3.886 volt divided by 5 milliamps, which is equal to 777.2 ohm. Next, we will calculate the value of drain resistance R by applying the KVL rule across the output terminal of the MOSFET RD is equal to 20 volt minus 10 volt divided by 5 milliamps by simplifying this we will get RD is equal to 2 kilo ohm finally we need to calculate the value of resistor R1 and the resistor R2 we know that voltage divider current ID is equal to 0 0.1 milliamps 
this is the common practice to ensure the gate current is negligible and we will assume the same current through the voltage divider as before by applying the voltage divider rule at the junction a which is equal to gate voltage vg is given by vg is equal to vdd into r2 divided by plus r2 by plugging the given value vg is equal to 3.3 volt equal to 20 volt into r2 divided by r1 plus r2 we can consider this as equation 1 here r1 and r2 connected in series so that i div is equal to 20 volt divided by r1 plus r2 we can consider this as equation 2 by considering second equation r1 plus r2 is equal to 20 volt divided by 0 0.1 milliamps which is equal to 200 kilo ohm let's plug the same value into the first equation then 3.3 uh, volt divided by 20 volt is equal to r2 divided by 200 kilo ohm so if we rearrange the term we'll get r2 is equal to 0 0.165 into 200 kilo ohm which is equal to 33 kilo ohm and earlier we have calculated the resistors r1 plus r2 is equal to 200 kilo ohm so that the value of r1 is equal to 200 kilo ohm minus 33 kilo ohm which is equal to 167 kilo ohm so finally we have calculated the resistor r1 as 167 kilo ohm and resistor r2 as 33 kilo ohm and the drain resistance rd is equal to 2 kilo ohm and the source resistance rs is equal to 777 point two ohm and the gate to source voltage vgs is equal to minus 0 0.586 volt so we have successfully calculated all the register value of our mosfet circuit i hope this video helped you to understand mosfet biasing calculation if you have any question leave them in the comment below don't forget to like and subscribe for more electronic tutorial. Thanks for the watching.